thank you very much, everybody. When this night was announced three months ago, I'd had a lot to drink. I said to a couple of people, do you know what I should do? Do you know what I should do? I should do a spoken word version of Crocodile Rock, but I'll do it with kazoo. And uh, somebody said, do you know what you should fucking do? That's a brilliant idea. And uh, they're not here. Um, which is fine. Uh, and it seemed like a great idea three months ago. Looking at you lot, not so sure now. But I guess in the next three minutes, we're going to find out what the C on my cap stands for. <laughs> so I am going to need your assistance. If you've got a kazoo, and that means you, Zach, um, uh, I'm going to need your help. Your tone is this. Everybody happy? Right, so tonight is a tribute to Mr. Elton John. But where would Mr. Elton John be without a Mr. Bernard Taupin? Sainsbury's! He'd be, he'd be in Sainsbury's. Stacking shelves. Facing up. No. You still would be at his age though. Given the way that the pensions payment in this country is going, then probably yes. Uh, so I took one of his finest songs and I thought I'd translate it into a bit of poetry. Here it is, Crocodile Rock. Yeah. I remember when Rock was young, me and Susie had so much fun, holding hands, skimming stones. Had an old Chevy and a place of my own. That's not going to happen these days. But the biggest kick I ever got was doing a thing called the Crocodile Rock. While the other kids were rocking round the clock, we were hopping and bopping to the Crocodile Rock. Well. Crocodile rocking is something shocking when your feet just can't stand still. I never knew me a better time and I guess I never will. Oh lordy mama, that doesn't sound like coming from my mouth. <laughs> Those Friday nights when Susie wore her dresses tight and the crocodile rocking was out of sight. And this is where I need your help. One, two, three, four. Stop! No! But the years went by and the rock just died. Susie went and left me for some foreign guy. Ooh, shame on Susie. Long nights crying by the record machine, dreaming of my Chevy and my old blue jeans. But they'll never kill the thrills we've got. Burning up the crocodile rock. Learning fast as the weeks went past, we really thought the crocodile rock would last well. Crocodile rocking is something shocking when your feet just can't stand still. I never knew me a better time, and I guess I never will. Oh lordy mama, those Friday nights when Susie wore her dresses tight, Crocodile Rocking was out of sight. One, two, a one, two, three, four. <laughs> Thank you very much.